I'm here with Peggy from the Midshore Women's Journal. And could you tell us a little bit about the event that we're at tonight? Uh, we're here for our second annual Cancer Survivor Warrior event. We're hoping to make it a yearly tradition. And the main reason for uh, the celebration is to bring cancer survivors and warriors from the Midshore area, strictly for inspiration and to establish some friendships and it's such a small community to begin with. And it's just great to bring people together that are kind of going through some tough times or have been through some tough times. So it's just a way to have, bring them all together and have some fun. And why did you choose to have it at Bridges? Well, Bridges is one of our main contributors to the journal. They've been with us since we started a couple years ago. They're wonderful people to work with. It's a gorgeous setting. It's probably the prettiest one on the, on the island or in the, in the Eastern Shore. And uh, very accommodating. And have you tried the food? The food is fabulous. So. <laughs> So I grab Bob here, he's going to be performing tonight, singing, so what brought you here tonight? A uh, good friend of mine, Peggy, um, we've been friends for a couple years and she asked me if I'd come down and perform uh, for the cancer survivors and this is the second year I've done it and um, it's a great organization and it, it gives hope and gives support to a lot of people and um, it, it really acknowledges the people that are going through it and the battle they fought and um, as a pancreatic survivor myself I'm always willing to, to jump in and, and help out and I know how terrible it can be so I'm, I'm honored to be here. I'm here with Debbie from Exit Gold Realty and we just wanted to talk to her about why she came to the event and what brought her here. Well, hi Mallory. I'm here supporting of the Women's Home Journal and the cancer benefit that they're putting on here. It's a beautiful night. We're out here just enjoying ourselves and we do advertise in the Women's Journal. Get a lot of calls from that. It's a great, great magazine. It's mostly in the dentist office and doctor's office, so it's a great magazine. It's like a tabletop magazine. But we're out here just supporting there are cancer survivors and hoping everybody's enjoying the nice night and the beautiful weather and great music and food and just having a great time. Just glad to be here. I'm now talking with Jean, so can I ask you how you got involved with this event tonight? Well, Peggy Ford emailed me at work, and I thought, who in the world is Peggy Ford? But then when I saw Midshore Women's Journal, I thought, I love that magazine. So she asked if I knew any cancer survivors, and I knew a lot of them. So, and I know a girl that needs, you know, that has nothing, and she had breast cancer two years ago, so I nominated this lady. I'm here talking with Charlotte and Judy, and could you tell me what business you're representing tonight? We're from the Gifted Crab and the Kent Island Frame Shop, located on Castle Marina Road here in Chester. What kind of items do you have in your shop? We have coastal, local, and unique items, many personalized items, and whatever you're looking for, we'll try to find it for you. And how did you get involved with the event that is tonight? Actually, Peggy is a good friend of ours and a supporter of our store. We're celebrating our first year. She invited us. I'm actually a cancer survivor, and uh, we did some donations, so she invited us to the event. And how long have you been doing the framing for the Gifted Crab? Well, I've been with the Gifted Crab since they started about a year ago, but I've been doing picture framing for about 35 years. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which is part of our Ken Allen Frame Shop. I'm studying under Judy, who's teaching me uh, so many things I couldn't even begin to tell you. I went to framing school, but doesn't doesn't even come close to what Judy's taught me. And uh, we're just having a ball and enjoying ourselves, and you know, we're 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 making it work. We're here talking to Glenn right now because we noticed that his shoes actually match his belt. Coordinated his outfit very well. So what are you doing here tonight? I'm actually here performing magic. And I'm also here for the, uh, the benefit, obviously, to honor the sur cancer survivors here and to be at the Women's Journal, Midshore Women's Journal uh, event. So, having a lot of fun here. Looks like everybody's enjoying themselves and great weather. Yeah. 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 
So we hear you're a magician. Are you any good? I believe so. Whoa, that was weird. Well, we've had a great evening here at Bridges filled with Elvis entertainment, magic, and great food. And it's only the second annual event, so we look forward to many more in the future. Come on, sugar. Woo. Oh, sugar.